Welcome to the Veterans Gaming Podcast. This is Season 5, Episode 7 of my Bristol City Career Mode. In my last uh, video, uh, in my last match, I was able to beat Manchester United 5-3. Mason Greenwood uh, got the game tying goal and the game winning goal. Then we added another goal, so we are on top of the Premier League. But, hey, Rocky, what's up? But right now, you just tuned in. I just started like a few seconds ago. So now uh, I'm going to go play uh, the Carabao Cup. This is going to be round four. I'm going to go up against uh, Aston Villa, who play 4-4-2 holding. Obviously, Nicholas Jackson and Diaby are going to be the big threats. Um, the captain, Amy Martinez, the Gold Cup winner, excuse me, World Cup winner, is at, at goal. Uh, they use a lot of wing play. So... I'm gonna put a I'm gonna put a very strong lineup uh, against them, but uh, in the Carabao Cup, I'm not going to uh, do a training. I'll save that for the league. All right. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna start. Oops, excuse me. I'm gonna start Correa. I'm gonna start him at goalkeeper. I'm kind of not happy with Lavakovic as of late. So let's put Maduke. Put Mason Greenwood. I'm going to start Doak. I'm going to start Sawa. And I'm going to start Adeyemi. I'm going to put Pereira. And I'm going to start Prestiani as well. Get him a start. Instead of Dominguez, I'm going to start uh, Xavier Simmons. Let's see. Oh, okay. Yeah, the computer will screw you like that sometimes, unfortunately. Uh, I'll start Fresneda, and I'll have Ferreira as the backup. And uh, I'm gonna keep I'm gonna keep these big time starters just in case. I'm not gonna start Greenwood. And I think with what I've got here, I should be okay. But <clears throat> I'm going to put in a uh, Alma Bamidel and. I'm going to put in Barbosa. Schlotterbeck will be the captain. Oh, wait. Why do I got Maduke here as a goalkeeper? What am I doing? What did I do here? I screwed something up. Uh, where is uh, Correa? Okay. Maduke needs to come in for Livakovic. There we go. Okay. Now we're, now we're talking. Uh, I think this lineup should be good enough to beat Aston Villa. So let's go. Let's make it happen. There I am with Unai Emery. So let's see what happens in the Carabao Cup. Uh, I won the Premier League and the FA Cup last season, but you know what? Might as well try to go for the quadruple instead of the treble. So why not? Why not? Now, I will say if I do win the treble, which is the league, the FA Cup, and the Champions League, I will probably finish uh, this career mode and go into another one with a whole new team. But we'll see. Fresneda, Barbosa, Omar Bamidele, Schlotterbeck, Pereira. Oh, good, good job, Dest. Diaby. Diaby, he's gonna be a he's a he's a problem. Oh, what a pass! That was an incredible pass. Oh, oh, good save by Correa. Good save with his leg. All right. Okay, good. That was a good sliding tackle by Dest. Prestiani. Oh, bad pass there. So Young, Beto, Young, Miranda, Tielemans, Miranda, Tielemans, Miranda again. Neto, oh, that went right under the keeper. I mean, he blew that chance. That was a one. That was one nothing right there. 
Christiani, Sawa, Doak. Oh, good, def good defending by Miranda. Beto, Diaby, Dust, Diaby. Okay, good defending by Slaughterback. Good defending, good defending overall there. Pareda. There you go. Oh, come on, Doak. Chambers. Oh, he just missed Nicholas Jackson. Nicholas Jackson is someone who used to kill us all the time at Chelsea. Wow, who are you using as a that you got robbed of player of the month? Fresneda. Prestiani. Dope. Sawa. Sawa. Adeyemi. Oh. Awesome. Atrocious passing this first half. Leroy. Tillemans. There we go. Okay, that's out. Okay, you made myself. Okay, nice. I mean, Aston Villa has been a Put up a good, good challenge so far. Oh, Miranda's out here killing Doak. Yarek. Miranda. Sawa. That was brutal. That was a brutal miss. It's the first shot we've had all game, really. There, Emmy Martinez. Gentlemen's Chambers. Nicholas Jackson. Barbosa. Adeyemi. Simmons. Good pass to Fresnella. Prestiani. Doak. Oh. That's all sides. Ah, oh, man. Been struggling this first half. Especially Doak. Again. Emasculated here by Miranda. Schlotterbeck. Oh, offsides on Pereira. There you go, Savior Simmons. Prestiani. Oh. No, but we got the right the right bounce there. Prestiani. Saved by Martinez. Miranda. Doke. Oh, hold on. Ah, Miranda again. Schooling Doke. Okay. Nice defending there. Pereira. Oh, shit. Yarek. Miranda here. Oh, my God. Doak is having an embarrassing first half. Nicholas Jackson. 
That was a bad pass by Jackson. Pereira. Uh, it's not going to, that's not going to cut it. Chilamans. Good job. Okay, nothing, nothing at halftime. Uh, Aston Villa, quite frankly, they've been a, uh, they've been better than us in this first half, but no score. So, Simmons, excellent defending. Oh, Prestiani, 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 score. Nope, but Pereira's there on the rebound, and it's 1-0 Bristol City. Okay, that was actually a good shot by, by uh, Fresneda, excuse me, by uh, Prestiani. Not too, t not too hard of a shot. And it's one nothing. Pereira, perfect, perfect positioning. And actually, Adeyemi being there, uh, he was kind of a decoy, so to speak, even though that wasn't his intention. So it's one nothing, Bristol City. But now you know that uh, Aston Villa is really going to uh, put the pressure on. All right, here we go, Leroy. Nicholas Jackson, Tielemans, Yarek, Leroy. Oh, come on. Come on. That was beyond unlucky. Wow. Unbelievable. I don't even, there's, there's kind of really nobody to blame for that. Correa. Oh, man. Talk about it. That shit luck right there. All right. T-Element. Aston Villa, they got some momentum now. Dope, nice. Okay. Oh, beautiful defending there. Mm. Whew. That was almost two to one there. Oh, that was a corner. Great save by Correa. <clears throat> All right. Doke. Nicholas Jackson, Tillemans. Oh, here we go. Oh, come on. What the heck? Dude, right here. Xavier Simmons, you should have you should have moved forward. No, oh, offsides. Xavier Simmons should have ran forward. That was a that was a breakaway. Okay, 60 minutes in. Slaughter back. Oh, Pereira, Pereira. Okay, what's what's the call? Okay, look at the a foul foul against uh, Pereira. Okay. Martinez. Oh, dog.
Oh, what a save by Correa. Ooh. Oh, incredible. 20 minutes left. Okay. Okay, we got to run here. Oh, come on, Adeyemi. Diaby. Diaby with his dangerous speed. Wow, fuck. Two to one. Okay. Okay, we might end up being out of the League Cup here. Restiani. Okay. Nicholas Jackson. Diaby, oh, the speed. Dope, what are you doing? Dope. Fresneda. Sawa. We're tied at two. All right. All right. We're still in the League Cup. Okay, it's time to make a substitution. Sawa, right here. Beautiful. Pereira, beautiful shot there. Man of the match. Let's go for the win here. And uh, go with my Duque here. And let's go with Mason Greenwood here. And let's go for the win. <clears throat> okay. Ben Doe, quite frankly, that was a, a shit match. But, oh, look at Sawa. Maduke, Maduke coming in as a sub. Oh, okay, five minutes left. Can we score before extra time? Oh, here we go. Mason Greenwood. Oh. Yarek. Oh, here we go. Pereira for the hat trick. Oh, we win. Maduke with another game winning goal in the last second of the game. And we are advancing in the Carabao Cup. What a last second win that was. Yes, sir. Yes. You should be happy, Correa. What a win. What a win right here. Pereira, the man of the match. And Emmy Martinez, no chance. No chance at all. It helped that Pereira had two goals. And that's a wrap, folks. What a comeback in the Carabao Cup. Maduke, another last, uh, last second goal there. He did it in that epic against Man City. And that's it with the last kick of the match. The Robins advance.
in the Carabao Cup, making this a season to remember. Amazing win. That was incredible. Carlos Pereira, no question, man of the match. Wow. Wow. Straight out of our youth academy, too. All right. So, right now, the quest for the quadruple is still on. What a comeback. And I think we just broke Aston Villa's confidence there. Let's go with performance. Uh, there's Sawa with an assist. Maduke with a game-winning goal. Doke, 7.1, but I don't think he played that great, to be honest. Xavier Simmons, solid. Prestiani, solid. Carlos Pereira, man of the match, two goals and an assist. I think the defense was overall solid. And Correa was not, he wasn't great, but he wasn't terrible. So, still, uh, goalkeeping is kind of rocky, so to speak. Carlos Pereira got the, goal, got the uh, first goal here in the 50th minute. Good, but good shot by Prestiani. Pereira, Johnny on the spot there. And that made it, uh, I mean, couldn't have bounced any better. And it's one nothing. I think that's his first goal for us, but I'm not sure. But without a doubt, without a doubt his best match. His best match for us. Beto ties it. And that was a, a lucky shot that hit the goalkeeper. But Correa played good enough. And then uh, Mano Kone got the second goal. And then here, Pereira starting the comeback. Sawa. See, the defender saw him too. But Pereira too fast. He blows by Dest on this one to tie the game at two. And then right here, Maduke. Pereira right here. Maduke. And that was it. What a comeback. What a comeback by Bristol City. And we advance in the Carabao Cup. Wow, what a game. What a win. What a win. Uh, Swansea and Arsenal, looks like they went to penalties. I don't know who won. Arsenal, they won on penalties. We advance. Nottingham Forest. Norwich, Arsenal, us. And then uh, Chelsea, Liverpool beat Crew Alexandra, Leicester City beat West Brom, and Spurs advance against Watford. All right, let's do a quick interview here. What a great match. Uh, congratulations. You think how far can we go? Hey, you know what? In the Carabao Cup, we haven't done well in this competition, but I think anything is possible now. So, wouldn't be surprised if we went all the way. What are your thoughts about uh, Perea? Man, he was an that was an absolute star performance by him. And going up against a real good right back, Dest. Was it? Uh, did you have some luck on your side? Uh, no, I think this is a team that just keeps fighting until the very last minute. And that's why we've had a we've had a situation. Sheffield United in the league, we were losing. We got a last second goal against Man City. We got a last second goal to win, and then this. So, oh, we got a our next game on the seventh is going to be against Crystal Palace, who's sitting near the bottom of the table. Uh, nothing. The Netherlands. I'm not taking that job. Stade Luzon. Uh, they want uh, Kwame Yeboah. That's fine. Xavier Simmons. Let's put him. Uh, let's put him on a performance-based uh, training plan. Let me see where he is. Right here. I might start him the next match. Let's advance. Okay. Let's go. This is going to be match day. 11, let's take a look at the standings. Uh, right now, we are five points clear of Manchester United because of that win that we had against them last uh, last time out. Uh, even with a game in hand, 
We're six points clear of Man City. We could go nine points clear of them with a win. And uh, 11 points clear of Chelsea, et cetera, et cetera. Liverpool in seven, really, seventh, really struggling. Arsenal in 17, who would have thought? Uh, Crystal Palace, they sit uh, second to bottom of the table, six points. So uh, let's go out here, get a win against Crystal Palace. Let's look at the calendar before I go any further. Okay, so I've got Crystal Palace away. And then I've got a, a home game in the Champions League against Copenhagen. If I'm able to win that uh, that match against Copenhagen, I'm uh, I'm advancing to uh, the round of 16, and so the other two games really ain't gonna they're really not gonna matter. But let's concentrate on the task at hand, which is going to be the game against Crystal Palace. Let's go to match day pre match report. They're struggling. They've lost three out of their last four. They've got Angolo Conte. But I'm sure he's not, you know, in his prime. We do have to worry about Mendy and uh, Bino Gittens on the left and Moretti. So they do have some some players that can play. They use wing play as their uh, tactical vision. But for whatever reason, it's not coming together for Crystal Palace. So we want to we want to stay on them. So let's go uh, pinpoint crossing as our training, and let's make this happen. Nice. That worked out great. Let's go. Nope. Let's try this. Oh, crap. Okay. Beautiful. Beautiful. All right. Excellent. We got all the points we needed. All right, let's go. Ah, not quite. A little too far there. But this training session is going. Oh, beautiful header. Beautiful header. Yes, sir. 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 Here's another one. You're watching the Veterans Gaming Podcast. This is Season 5, Episode 7 of my Bristol City Career Mode. Just pulled off a great comeback in the Carabao Cup to beat Aston Villa 3-2. to two. These guys are going to have these temporary play styles. Uh, power shot for Armada. Dead ball for Simmons. Zay for Shavi Simmons, excuse me. Nicolas Dominguez, power header. Relentlessness for uh, Schlotterbeck. And power shot for Nuamua. So let's go to the match here, and we're going to go to Selhurst Park. Uh, looks like everybody's on point except for Prestiani. So I'm going to sit him. I'm going to play my top dogs for this match. But I'm going to reward Pereira, and I'm going to start him against Crystal Palace. Even though he's kind of out of energy there, I'm, I'm going to reward him. For that heck of a performance, man of the match performance. Uh, let's see, Correa. Let's put a uh, McAtee. Let's put um, let's put Maduke. Let's sit. Uh, excuse me. You know what? I'm gonna sit Prestiani down to let him rest, and I'm gonna go with a uh, Mason Greenwood, and I'm gonna sit down Doak and start Gill. No, you know what? No, 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 no. I'm gonna put Murillo. Give Murillo, give Murillo a fair, a fair shake here. And then I'm gonna have uh, Barbosa as the backup center back. And I think with this lineup right here, we should be able to uh, should be able to handle Crystal Palace. I don't know what the best start is in Premier League history. I'm gonna have I'm gonna have to uh, look it up. But uh, Thiago Almada, top goal scorer with nine. So he's on he's on his way to 27. It's a, a quieter 27 than last season. So 
so let's go out here against the Eagles and make it happen. I think that's Roy Hodgson, who I believe in real life is under fire at Crystal Palace. Let's go. Let's go, Robbins. Miretti. Miretti is a good player. Look at Miretti. Look at Antonio Silva. What? What? What greatness. No more. Oh. No more, no more. Goal, one nothing. Adeyemi, yes, sir. Excellent. Great vision by No more. Great unselfish play. Great hustle by Adeyemi, and it's one nothing Bristol City. Okay, excellent. So we've got the early lead. So let's uh let's stay on top of Crystal Palace. Seven goals in ten matches for Adeyemi. So you know my my guys up front, they're they're playing they're playing well, they're getting goals and uh, making things a lot easier for the midfielders and for the defenders. Uh oh, oh no Nam came to play today. Oh, what a pass. Oh. 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 Lerma. Okay. Scally. Miretti. Oh, Livakovic, good save. Good save. Almada. Mm. Oh, what a pat. Oh. Deadly. Okay, good. That was good defending. Almada. That's out. That's going to be a corner. It's going to be a corner for Bristol City. Good defending there. I'll give it, I'll give it to him. Okay. Corner. Oh, what a shot by Adeyemi. What a shot. Corner. Amala. Uh oh. What's the counter? Shamidi. Scally. Oh, good save. Good save by uh good save by Livakovic, keeping the clean sheet. Oh, that should be a red card. Oh, he's hurt, too. Damn it. That should be a red card. It's only a yellow for me, ready. Okay. Ah, oh, shoot. I got a problem now. Okay, Fresneda. Let's see who's got the most pace here. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to put Murillo. I'm going to have to put him in there. Charlie Simmons. What a shot. Great shot. 
Okay, Fresnel is going to come out. Wow, Mori is going to have to play left back. Hey, man up, bro. Dominguez. Nope. All right. Okay, let's see what we got here. John Stone. Oh, but hey, you should have passed it to a. Uh... Oh, no, that's okay. Antonio Silva, right there. Ah, outside. All right, still one nothing. Bristol City, go. Okay. Oh, 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 for Mendy. Oh, nice, Murillo. What can you do at left, at right back? Not. Nah. Okay, that's uh, should be our ball. All right, let's keep it going here. Thirty-three minutes in. Pereira. Xavi Simmons. Mm, mm, mm. Uh oh. Oh, slaughter back. World class. Better it out. Oh, crap. Trimmy D. Boy. Oh, crap. Okay. We should have cover. Oh, what a save by Livakovic. Mm, that's beautiful one-handed save there. Okay, Dominguez oh, taking a leap of faith there. Okay, Dominguez, nice job. And that's a corner. It's another corner for Crystal Palace. Good job, Livakovic. Gets it out quickly to Antonio Silva, who's making a run by himself. Oh, no, I'm Oh, another save by Livakovic. Okay. Livakovic has been on form today because Crystal Palace should probably have a couple of goals right now. Close to halftime. Dominguez. Oh, slaughter back. Okay. Uh, do we have time to try to get another goal? Nope. Nope, nope, halftime. All right, we're up one nothing at halftime here at Selhurst Park. Uh, quite frankly, Crystal Palace has been giving us a battle. I think overall they've probably been a little bit of a better team right now, but we are we got the one nothing lead. So let's go out here and get a couple of goals here. And uh, more importantly, let, let's keep the clean sheet because it's been a while since we've had a clean sheet. Pereira. Oh, what a move. Pereira. No. Mendy. Getting to, oh shit. Ah, world class by Schlatter back there. Murillo playing out of position. But Murillo. 
Almada. Oh, just missed. Just missed. Making it 2-0. Okay, Murillo did pretty good there. Johnstone with a goal kick. Oh, fuck. Oh. Ignacio. Shalotta back. Shabby Simmons, who's been very quiet. Oh, oh, okay. Oh, beautiful save. Oh, what a save by Livakovic. On form. Man. Crystal Palace should probably have about three goals right now. And he skies it. Oh, that's got to be frustrating. Murillo with a foul. Oh, boy. Substitution. Okay, he's out. Okay, here we go. Oh, fuck. Oh, he's hurt too? Who's this? Dominguez is hurt? Mala. Okay. Almada. 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 Ah. Ponte. Oh, no, no. Oh. What a save by the another save. Almada. Oh, come on. Lerma. Gittins. Oh, another save by Livakovic. Okay, well, 15 minutes left here. Another save by Livakovic. Man, got like 60 saves today. Let me guess. Oh, Adeyemi. Oh, fuck. Pereira. No. Oh, my God. This has been a hard fought battle here. Okay. Woo. Ten minutes left. All right. Let's uh Pereira is dead on arrival here. So he is uh Gaz has to come in for the last ten minutes. Let's put McAtee in for Simmons. Sawa in. Let's go with uh Greenwood on the left and Maduke on the right. Let's get another goal. Oh, I'm out of subs. Okay. Okay, that won't happen. All right.
Okay, let's get some fresh legs here from these last 10 minutes. Lerma. Pante. Ignacio. Oh, what a shit pass. Mason Greenwood. Oh, fuck. Lerma. Miretti. Well, five minutes left here. Murillo. That's our ball. Beautiful. McAtee. Dominguez. No, no, Dominguez. Ignacio, beautiful. Giles. Mason Greenwood. McAtee. There we go. Murillo. No. We hang on, though. Yes, we hang on. We win one nothing. A hard-fought battle at Crystal Palace, but we get all three points. We get the clean sheet. Crystal Palace still in 19th. What a hard-fought defensive battle that was. Wow. Kareem Adeyemi with the goal in the 23rd minute. It's a W, and that's all that matters. We should have been a lot more impressive against the Eagles, but hey, in the fifth minute, I'm sorry. But uh, uh, Livakovic was a monster. He was an absolute monster. Nuomo with the assist early. Everybody else was kind of so-so. Uh, Murillo, man, he he did what he could there as a as the right back. Eleven saves for uh, Livakovic. He earned 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 his pay. Earned his pay today. Here's the only goal of the match. That was it, and everything else was uh, it was the Livakovic show. Look at this save right here. This might have been the best one out of them all, right there. Oh, uh, yeah, he was uh he was on fire. He was on fire. All right, let's go to the post match interview and then the Champions League match, match day four. Eleven games unbeaten in a row. And, uh, you know, even as, as these games have gone on, we, we've been looking stronger and stronger. So you got the goal. Second half was a different story. You know what, everybody? Everybody on the team did their job. So everybody did their job. We got the win. We got the three points. Managed to get the deciding goal. Uh, you know, we defended spectacularly. So, Livakovic was uh, impenetrable. Credit to him for keeping the clean sheet. All right. Let's look at the popularity. It's 85. All right. So, let's uh, advance. Okay. Let's look at the inbox. Carlos Perea, let's give him, uh, where's he at? Carlos Perea, let's put him on an energy-based uh, training plan. And let's go out there and get this win. Let's look at the standings first. Right now, we've got nine points. If we can beat uh, Copenhagen again, guess what? We are in. With that goal difference, there's absolutely no way that we'd be able to blow uh, 
blow our chances. So let's go out here and make this happen. Pre-match report. You know, we we put it on them. Um, Lund is out. Their uh, main winger. I think he got a red card the last game against us. Bonnie is hurt. Um, they play a four three three. They're gonna do gang and pressing. Uh, I think we I think we should be able to beat them. Let's uh, since they gang and press, let's do the collector trophies training session. And uh, let's go from there. Let's go. Come on now. There we go. All right. Okay, that was very good. Okay, we are just about got the points needed. We are going to clinch it right here. All right. Let's do this here. Okay, let's, uh, that's it. So, uh, and I'm going to put my, uh, in order to clinch, to clinch this, uh, to clinch this, I'm going to put my, uh, I'm going to put my top dogs, but let's go to the press conference because we've got a chance to clinch advancing to the uh, round of 16 in the Champions League. One win away from uh, qualifying. Are you confident? You know it. It's in our hands. So we've got ourselves in a good position. And... Uh, it's in our hands, and I'm expecting them to do everything they can to finish the job. What am I expecting? You know, uh, we know I know what I want from the team, and uh, I'll make changes necessary. But you know, um, I'm happy with where we're at. We ripped them apart, winning for nothing. Are you expecting another kind of performance right now? You know what? We'll we'll stay humble. We'll stay humble, and uh, we're going to go out there and get the job done. Because of the way Livakovic played, I am going to start him here instead of Correa. The confidence is sky high. What I'm going to do, I'm going to replace Inacio, put a Mofa in, and then on my body, I'm gonna put on my body. No, I'm gonna put Barbosa in here. Correa, where is uh McAtee? Mustard Prestiani on the right. Oh, let me go. Where's, where the heck is McAtee? Where the heck is? Yeah, I'm going to put McAtee in for Simmons. I'm going to step Sawa for Nuamwa. Let's see. Pereira. I'm going to sit out. I'm going to put in uh, Ferreira. Okay, Fresnel is good to go. He's not hurt, so I'm going to let I'm going to put him in. But uh, I'm going to actually I'm gonna be cautious. Put Ferreira. Put Barbosa in for Schlotterbeck. I'm going to try that. I'm going to keep Silva as the captain. Then I'm going to put uh, Xavier Simmons. And where's Greenwood? Greenwood. I'm going to start Greenwood instead of Almada. And uh, should I put Maduke? No, I'm gonna put Maduke instead of Simmons. Give Simmons a break. I'm gonna put Gill instead of Normal. We should be fine. We should be fine. And for our mother, I want him to rest too. 
but no one I can trust. So I'll keep in my problem point though. Okay. Let's go out there and qualify for the uh around the 16 of the Champions League. So, exciting times. Exciting times in Bristol City, England. Okay, hopefully Mason Greenwood gets a goal. Maybe that's maybe that's my cue to give him the ball. We beat them four to nothing in their house. Match day three. Okay, come on, Pereira. A mofo. What was that? Dicks. Yeah, we emasculated these guys last time. Oh, that's the one. That was going to be one nothing there. Antonio Silva, excellent defending there. Oh, here we go. Giles, Giles, Giles. McAtee. Oh, he just missed. Just missed. Young? Holland. Simmons. Giles. The pass could have been so much better there. Simmons, nope. All right, still 0-0. Zero, zero. Uh, we're 15 minutes in. Okay, I think uh, last game we had four goals like 30 minutes in. Oh, who just missed? He just, I knew he'd missed too. Oh, what are you doing, Giles? Oh, Sawa almost almost made a big play there. Prestiani. Oh. Missed. Okay. Young. Simmons. Okay, that's a foul. No call. Should have been a card. Success. Simmons, shop, shop your Simmons. McAtee. Put it on. McAtee. Oh, ooh, the keeper hit himself on the the post there. Oh, that's a corner. Okay. Greenwood. Ooh, Sawa. All right now, Young, Tomelling,
McAtee, McAtee. Oh, McAtee. Shoots. Good shot. Good shot. Kate, 30 minutes in. Oh, Melly. Shit. Oh, nice job. Prestiani. 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 Oh. Okay. Should have been one nothing there. Greenwood. Oh, good shot by Prestiani. There. Greenwood. No. Young with the kick. Oh, Shavier Simmons. Success. Nope. Good defending there. Okay. Okay, we need we need something here out before halftime. No, that's not what we needed. Good job by Balbosa there. And Giles. Okay, Giles, is he going to take it himself? He is. Greenwood. Oh, what a shot. There we go. Greenwood. Balbosa, no. Sawa, 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 Sawa. Oh, Maka T hit the post. Wow. Okay, it's tied at zero in the Champions League. We need a win here to uh, get to the round of 16, but my goodness, it hit the post towards the end of the half. So Copenhagen out here giving a great effort. He's committed. Oh, he skied it. All right, good. Good. Mofa, good job. Sawa. Sawa, one nothing. Oh, wow. What a save by Young. Okay, let's see. Let's see. Corner by Greenwood? No. Wow, we're struggling here, uh, getting the ball in the back of the net. Giles, excellent defending. McAtee. Prestiani. It's one nothing. finally. All right. Good defending there. one nothing. Bristol City, and so looks like we're on our way to uh, the round of 16 of the UEFA Champions League, uh, which would mean we've already got three wins. So those last two games against Bayern Munich and PSV won't be of any, any significance. Prestiani, right there, finishes it. Great assist by Greenwood. Beautiful. 
Beautiful. So, one nothing for Gianluca Prestiani. Okay. Holland. McAtee. McAtee. Greenwood. Sawa. Good save. Great save by Young. Amazing save. Greenwood. Cross. Sawa. Ah. It's a shit header. Okay, goal kick. Ferreira, Ferreira, Ferreira. Oh, almost two to nothing there. Okay, Jordi. Oh, what a move by Jordi. Okay, all right. Giles. Greenwood. Greenwood. Two nothing. That's it. That's a wrap. That's a wrap. Prestiani with the brace. And we will be heading to the round of 16 in the UEFA Champions League. Copenhagen ain't coming back from this. Nice job, Greenwood. Prestiani gets behind the defense. This has been a specialty of mine. Right here. And let's see. Uh, can Livakovic get another clean sheet? Let's uh try to secure that. Uh, let's let's put Gill in instead of Sawa. And uh I think that should be it. I think that's all I'm going to do here. I'll keep everybody else where they are. Well, hold that thought. Wasn't a... Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's, that's good. That's good. Let's see if Gil can get a score here. Johansson. Greenwood. Oh. Okay, okay. Nice job, guys. Greenwood. Greenwood. Greenwood taking himself. No, he was going to pass it to the. Jordy, good save. Good save, Milakovic. All right, 20 minutes left. Can we hold it? Giles, a stupendous game. Oh, excellent. Milakovic gets it out of there quick, too. Oh, salacious pass there. Greenwood, Greenwood. Three nothing. That's a wrap. All right. And great defending as well. Let the celebration begin. Bristol City headed to the round of 16 of the UEFA Champions League. And we've been absolutely blistering the competition. Mason Greenwood, normally a right, uh, right midfielder, but on the left, he's been absolutely sensational as well. What a great signing he's been. Uh, my big three signings, Greenwood, Maduke, and McAtee, made a real difference. Taking the pressure off my uh, my usual starters, Amofa. Oh, here we go, Gil. Oh, that should have been four nothing. Thank you, Violet. 
Oh, that should have been four nothing right there. Ah, oh. Greenwood knows he missed a he missed his chance there. Look at this. Okay, no, I won't be I won't be trying that kind of corner kick anymore. All right, it's uh, twelve minutes remaining. Uh oh. Good job. Oh, Xavier Simmons. Impressive. Thank you. Impressive defending. I'll, I'll follow you whenever I'm done here. Thank you. Hope you're liking this podcast. Prestiani. Uh oh, Prestiani. Going for the hat trick. No. Okay. We are about seven minutes away from a. Uh, Oh, what a quality tackle by Amofa. Oh, that was a shit pass, though. That was a shit pass from Mason Greenwood. But, oh, he makes up for it. Oh, crap. Oh, that's on Xavier Simmons there. But we're... Okay. Oh, here we go. Oh, Greenwood out here. Blowing people out the water. Whoa, that should have been five. Uh, may maybe later. All right. Oh, excuse me. That should have been four. Oh, my goodness. That would have been an epic uh, solo goal there. Let's go with the curl here. Greenwood. Let's see. Okay, let's keep it up. Uh, let's keep that clean sheet. Come on. Oh. Oh shit! No. Thank you, McAtee, and that's it. That's it. Thank you. That's it. We are headed to the round of 16 of the UEFA Champions League in our first ever, ever Champions League uh, campaign. So we win three to nothing. Gianluca Prestiani with a brace. So he, he came on strong. So I think what I'm going to do, I'm going to end this episode here in a little bit. And then maybe in about another hour or two, I'll go into the next episode. But uh, what a performance. And I got back-to-back -back clean sheets in the league and now here in the Champions League. Let's look at performances. Mason Greenwood, a goal and two assists, 9.8 performance. Uh, my man is all here trying to make a, earn himself a start against Leeds, Leeds United. Looks like he deserves it. Prestiani with two goals. Xavier Simmons with an assist. Uh, solid defending. Uh, Ryan Giles, great performance, 8.4. Solid defending all around. Livakovic with three saves. Copenhagen, uh, not as good as... Uh, they were a few years ago when we played them in the Europa League. But, hey, they kept it scoreless until halftime, throughout the first half, and then this. Greenwood. Oh, what a pass to Prestiani. Made it one nothing, And it kind of slowly went downhill from there. Uh, I think Copenhagen's pretty much eliminated. I don't think they've won any games. That makes it one nothing. So it's kind of down to Bayern Munich and PSV for that second slot. <clears throat> Then Prestiani right here in the 66 minute. Greenwood again. Look at that. Ah, we've scored so many goals like that. I love it. I love that. Love those goals like this. Love it when our wingers are able to sneak in on behind the center back and the fullback. And then Greenwood right here takes it on his own. The defense defenders are tired. Look at the did you see the, the curl, the the spin on that ball as it's going in? From the outside foot, oh, Mason Greenwood, 
a serious, serious talent hitting his prime. I'm glad we got him from Man United. Let's go to the post-match interview. Bayern Munich did win against PSV. We'll be playing Bayern Munich next, but it doesn't matter. We've, we're in the round of 16. So you've secured qualification. That's an achievement. What happens now? We'll see who we, let's see who we draw. Hopefully this is only the beginning. Uh, we'll continue being strong at the back and cool in the front. Then uh, who knows where we can go. The headline for Estiani's uh, great performance today. Couldn't have asked for anything more from him. He was absolutely stupendous. He showed up today for this match. Do you think we've got better players than... Uh, uh, no, but I would say uh, we, we're always dangerous looking forward. Even though it was nothing, nothing at halftime, I was 100% confident that we'd be able to get the result. And so we have. I'm not sure... Okay, here's the, uh, before we go any further, here's the Premier League standings. We're going to be hosting Leeds United. Uh, again, five points ahead of Man United right now. A big nine-point gap against over Man City. I'm liking that. 11 over Chelsea. And I've, it's really, right now, it's between us and Man United, and we've already beat them. We keep playing like this. Man, we're, we only had that one draw against Leeds United. Excuse me, not Leeds United, Sheffield United. Sheffield United almost beat us. They're sitting in 12th. Arsenal, I don't know what's going on, sitting in 17th. Uh, we're going to be playing bottom of the table, Leeds United, in our next match. But I'll save that for the next video. But right now, look, uh, after 11 games, 10 wins and only one defeat. Excuse me, 10, 10 wins, one draw. Let me, let me check myself there. Uh, let's advance. Okay, wow. That'll be November the 13th. And then after that, let's look at the calendar. I think we might finally get a little... Yeah, we're going to get a two-week break finally, because look at this. We've had one, two, three. We're going to have four match. It'll be four matches in a 10-day period. So, uh, And then after this, we'll go away to uh, Brighton and then... Uh, that uh, match day number five against Bayern Munich, which I'm quite frankly, I'm going to use a lot of the uh, players that I don't use all the time, which is going to be good for them. They'll get some playing time. Let's look at the inbox before we get out of here. Uh, from 18th to the 24th of November, all those guys will be on international duty, but that won't affect us as far as uh, us uh, in our matches. Okay, and then who wants to chat? Okay. Uh, let's see. Okay, I believe in you. So, good for him. Okay, so really, my team is, everybody's pretty much happy at this point. All right. So, that is going, I appreciate the follow, Violet Grace. Thank you very much. Um, this is going to end uh, episode seven of uh, the Bristol City Career Mode season five. Uh, probably in another hour or two, I'll probably come back and do uh, episode eight. If you want to follow me on Twitter, follow me at smoothop75. And also, if you want to follow me on Twitch or on YouTube, just type in Veterans Gaming Podcast 24 and you can follow me then and you can continue watching what so far has been an outstanding and incredible season here for the Bristol City uh, Robins. So until the next episode, this has been the Veterans Gaming Podcast.